What's up, YouTube? Infect is in here, coming at you guys on Kirby Curbs channel. Uh, just thought we'd do a video swap on our different Redox grab decks, and yeah, make sure to head out to my channel to look at Kirby Curbs build and subscribe to Kirby Curbs if you haven't already. He's an awesome YouTuber and a really cool dude. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's get on with my scrap uh, Redox deck. Um, Redox honestly made the deck a lot better than what it already was. Me personally, I have already ran scraps in real life, so I really do know how they work. Um, I ran scraps, of course, this was last format and beginning of this format, and then I just gave up on the deck. But you know, like it was a fun deck, of course, it's always going to be a fun deck because it's actually really powerful if used correctly, you know? That kind of thing. So, without further ado, let's get on with the deck profile. So, first, you run three scrap beasts. And what this does is it, it's just a level 4 tuner basically, but if it's destroyed by a scrap effect and sent to the graveyard, you can send, you could select one scrap monster in your graveyard, accept scrap piece and add it to your hand. So you can add Chimera back to your hand. And what does Chimera do? Is when he's normal summoned, you can special summon a scrap monster from your graveyard. Um, so pretty much, or a scrap tuner from your graveyard, sorry. So you special summon him and then you synchro for scrap dragon because you can only synchro for scrap cards in this, um, because Scrap Chimera's downfall is that he can only be single summoned for Scrap Monsters. But other than that, like, like it's not that bad if you think about it. Like, it's just an instant Scrap Dragon every turn. So, yeah. Then I play three uh, Ancient Gear Gadgetron Dragons, mainly because he's a 3000 beater with and level 8. So, you can overlay with Scrap Dragon to make level 8 exceeds, or just beat down the face with 3000 attack. So, yeah. I also tech in one Grand Mole because I don't like Ophion, and Ophion is really. Really, really sad when I play him, you know, just bouncing back and then swing for 3,000, that kind of thing. I also played three Redox and two Reactants because they're actually a really good engine on its own. If you ditch Redox with any Earth, you can special summon a monster from your graveyard. Um, I believe, right? Yeah, you can special summon a monster from your graveyard, so you just have to read those effects and you can discard this and any other Earth to special summon a Redox, go for level 7 plays, that kind of thing. You can also banish two Earths to special summon Redox from the graveyard, which is also pretty cool. His artwork is actually very, very sexy. He has like two drums on his head or something. I don't know. I just want to play drums on his head, like slap him in the head. And his face is pretty cool. And my dog doesn't stop barking. I don't know. It's kind of weird. So two Maxis, you know, for draw power and against E Dragon, it's going to be really good. And then two Photon Thrashers. The reason I play Photon Thrasher is because you go special summon, normal summon, synchro for eight. You make Crimson Blader here, and then you pretty much auto win against Elemental Dragons. So, I like having two full on Thrashers. So, for spells, you play a three Scrap Storm, and it's a quick play. And so, you can let's say you attack, they activate Deep Prison, you quick play this out of your hand. Select one face up Scrap Monster you control, send one Scrap Monster from your deck to the graveyard, then draw a card. So, pretty much what you do is activate Scrap Storm and Scrap Beast, send Chimera to the graveyard, draw a card, Scrap Storm activates and destroys Beast. And Beast Effect, since he's destroyed by a Scrap card, you can add one Scrap from your gear to your hand. So you add Chimera, next turn letting you do the Scrap Dragon play. So if anything, you can summon this, set this, and their end phase if they don't do anything. Or if they MST or something like that, make them waste resources. You activate this end phase or whatever, you know, when you ever need to activate it. And then next turn you have your Scrap Dragon play. Then I play two Scrap Yards. You can add one Scrap Tuner from, from your deck to the hand, so only three targets, so I only play two. Uh, heavy, Monster Reborn, Dark Hole. Heavy is good in this deck because you can destroy um, Gear Town, so it's not a bad idea at all. Uh, two Torrential Tributes because it's good for clearing the board or whatever. I like it. Some people don't. I think Torrential is really good. Two Compulses is the best trap in the format, in my opinion. Call of the Haunted, it works two ways because you can special summon anything. And then Scrap Dragon's effect to pop Call if it becomes dead and pop one of their cards. Uh, two Breakthrough Skill for Ophi on Hate. Uh, and Solemn Duo because it's Solemn Duo. These are some cards that I thought would work really excellent with the deck, and you guys should give it a try. Summoner Monk, Thunder King, Goblin Bird, Phoenix Chain, the Gravekeeper Engine, uh, MSTs in the main deck, maybe Grand Soil, and Effect Baylor, just to normal summon and synchro for 8, because synchroing for 8 is really strong. Or you can synchro for 5, or for 4, that kind of thing. So, extra deck is 2 Scrap Dragons, 1 Crimson Blader, 1 Celestial Dragon. He's level 11, so you just need Scrap Beast and Redox, and you can go into Celestial Dragon. Uh, one Stardust Dragon for the XCs, we play Heretic Sun Dragon of Heliopolis, Neo Galaxy Eyes, Tachyon Galaxy, Big Eye, Tachyon Dragon. I don't know why I said Tachyon Galaxy. Uh, Big Eye, Dracosac for level 4s, Cowboy, Maestro, Black Ship Chain, and Digusto Emerald. 
So let me know what you guys think about this deck. Overall, this deck is a really strong and actually like tier two deck, tier two to your two point five kind of thing. It's actually really strong, and if you play your cards correctly, you can do some massive OTK pushes. You know, having a couple of Gadgetron, the Scrap Dragon, uh, Draco Sack, that kind of thing. It makes really strong pushes, and I do recommend you try this out. Make sure to head out to my channel and maybe subscribe if you liked what you saw. And I upload daily videos. I upload deck profiles, card discussions, um, chats, stuff like that every day so make sure if you like daily videos to so make sure to go check out my channel and subscribe so thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it subscribe to kirby cubs if you haven't infect the xenon signing out peace guys